Hello and welcome back to the Fritz Shoots channel. I'm Fritz and today we're going to start our series, the long-awaited series, Range Reviews. Okay, so the first range that we're going to do a review on is the Wake County Firearms Education and Training Center in Apex, North Carolina. Let's face it, we all know I don't like indoor ranges in general. <laughs> this range was pretty impressive actually. There was a lot about it I liked and we'll, we'll get into some of that. So three of the most notable things about this range is that first of all it was well lit. It was not too bright, it wasn't too dark, and there was ample light downrange, which brings me to the second thing that I liked. Way downrange, 100 meter indoor range. That's pretty cool. So you can pretty much use anything under a 50 BMG. So I was able to sight in the uh, 30 odd six, and it was nice to be able to shoot that gun again. It's been a while, and uh, I do need to sight it in, so it's good to know that I can bring it there and blow off a little uh, 30 out 6 round every once in a while. Alright, so this range has a 100 meter lean and a 50 meter lean. And yeah, the 50 meter leans are multi-gun, just whatever kind of gun you use, anything under a 50 BMG. And the 100 meter is for rifles only. Now they don't sell ammo and I don't think they have any uh, eye or ear pro there so you have to bring your own. So basically what I wanted to do was uh, touch up on some scope adjustment and some red dot sight adjustment. Uh, I have a little co-witness on the 9mm carbine and I just wanted to make sure everything was dead center and it wasn't. So we had to make that adjustment, we did, and uh, the iron sights are still dead on, so you just fix your uh, your dot right there. Right, little co-witness. All right, so what I look for in a range mostly is the comfort factor. Is it comfortable? Is it something I could function in? And Will I be able to use it for what I need it for? So basically, outside of feeling completely violated having to go to an indoor range from what I'm used to. I'm trying to sow my oats! Please. So the best part about this range to me is that they don't have a problem with you filming. And uh, that's why I got some footage from the place. As far as indoor ranges go, I'm going to go ahead and give this range a two thumbs up. So that's it for the first installment of range reviews. And I did have fun over there, and I'm looking forward to going back over there. Since it is the county facility, it's free. So that's on my budget. Now I can actually possibly afford the ammo. Yeah. I got two more ranges I got to review in the area and I'm looking forward to them. Actually very close to where I am. Um, one's an indoor facility and one is an outdoor facility and I hear they have steel. Uh, Fritzy likes steel. Fritzy miss steel. Fritzy must have steel. I must have my steel targets. Alright, I hate long goodbye so goodbye. I'm Fritz. We'll see you next time on the Fritz Shoot channel. Like, subscribe, tell a friend, all that good stuff. Do it.